Hi, this is Scoggett, and I'm with Mrs. Scoggett. Good morning. And it's time for a Sunday drive with Scoggett. Today's drive is going to be down Slide Road, Lubbock, Texas. And it's going to be a, a pretty good drive. Uh, it's uh, partially in the country and then it goes into the city. Hope everybody's doing fine out there. Uh, uh, we're both doing pr uh, pretty good. So y'all continue to uh, uh, do well. So uh, Mrs. Scoggin, is it supposed to rain today or? Yeah, it's supposed to rain sometime this afternoon. They this say. afternoon. They say, but you know how it is. Ever stopped at a stoplight and waited for it to turn green? Yeah. I've done that several times. Ain't that, ain't that a dumb feeling? starting to build more and more uh, uh, houses out south, uh, south of town, I noticed, too. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's really building up. There used to be, not be no houses back there. Mm -hmm. But south of town, I mean, you just, that's where the houses ended. But now they're building these houses like crazy. Oh, yeah. That's a money-making thing now, uh, real estate. Well, there's some pretty houses over here. Yeah, they look like they're, they look like they're all build. brand new, too. You can drive into the carport. Yeah. I never was that rich. Shit, I would if I had money and I was like that rich, I'd give you something like that. That would be nice to be able to live in a nice big fancy house, but old Scoggin would never see that. But thankful for what I've got, and I've worked hard for it. Well, yeah. we both worked hard for it. Yeah, we did. So that's that's the main thing. Just be thankful for what you have. Yeah. Sheriff right there. I wonder who that is. I don't know. He's somebody just sitting there. Probably no one. Killing time. Watching the traffic. Mm hmm See what person runs the stop sign. That's the thing is, uh, I see signs what says now hiring. I mean, they're all over the place. 
And they, they're saying that nobody's applying. Being Sunday and all, uh, you plan on going to Bingo today, Mrs. Scoggin? Uh, yeah. You went yesterday and come home broke. <laughs> came home the way I went. <laughs> you come home the way you went. Like I kind of uh, told you about my uncle uh, going to going to Vegas in a Cadillac and coming home on a Greyhound bus. And the funny, funny uh, thing about about it is, the casino bought them the bus ticket home. They were nice enough because he spent all his money. Yeah. Felt sorry for him. They did. They felt sorry for him. Uh, Bongo was the top guy where he had had have the shirt on his back, fifty cents in his pocket. And Ford ball, ball tires with the wires sticking out, and he'd go across country. <laughs> he'd make it too. That's what's what's weird. He was an amazing guy. He was a lot of fun. Yeah, they must have just smoothed this one out. This one, not, you can tell it's yeah. like new. No bumps, no cracks, no nothing. Well, then, then again, like I say, the city of Lubbock keeps their uh, like roads nice. Yeah. They're not, you know, all potholes everywhere. If they see a pothole, they'll go patch it up. That's one thing I can say about the city. And I think they were doing, getting some more funds to even improve them even better. Yeah. Uh, last I heard on the news. Ten minutes till eleven. We got off to a late start today. So I guess I'll fire up the smoker and uh, smoke a rack of ribs today. Sounds good to me. Can't beat my ribs, I guarantee you. I just feel like firing up the smoker today would be a good day to do it. Mm -hmm. I got the ribs. Yeah. Already just got to repair them. I don't know if I'm going to do a video on it or not. I haven't decided yet.
get back to cleaning that garage out this, this week. Do it a, about an hour of time. There's so much stuff in there. Yeah. I got quite a bit of it done. I did it all last week. There's still so yeah, much stuff. Pass a little bit here and there. You'll get it done. Yeah. Then I need no to hurry. sweep it out. Gotta throw away all that stuff we don't need. Give it to charity. Give it to the Council for the Blind. I always give this, my stuff to them. They're a good organization. Yeah. It's not uh, the money stays like for the people with the blind and, and it helps uh, people with eye surgeries but can't afford it. Just it's a good thing. I keep donating my stuff to them. It's not like some of them where you feed in the pockets of a rich man what has a chauffeur, a chef, and lives in a mansion. You know, one of those type of charities. There, Those are all over the place. People making, uh, making millions of dollars. 90% goes in their pocket, 10% goes to the cause. This one, it's it, all the money goes to uh, keeping that thrift store open and uh, doing good stuff for people. Wow, we're almost to the loop. side of slide to the other slide slide runs uh, north to south so we're headed north we got the south plains ball on one side This car needs uh, uh, all kinds of suspension work done to it. Shocks are all broke. Uh, struts are all worn out. And you still drive. I still go. <laughs> the only time uh, when, it, when the only time I fix it is when it breaks. As long as the wheels roll, I go. I ain't gonna put no money into it. This car is so old. That's the thing. People put money in in old cars. This one, if anything major goes wrong, I'll just junk it. I'm, I'm not going to put a $5,000 engine in a, a 2008 car, you know. That's that's just crazy there. Yep. But it should last me a while. Uh, it's only uh, it's got 84,000 miles on it, so that still's good. I don't drive it. I, no, this is a town car. I, I don't take it out, out of the city anyway. This is just what I drive around town.
that you're going to run into me. Sometimes I wonder. Yeah, no, half the time they don't look at one way. That's the thing, they just look one way and then they pull out. You gotta look both ways. You know what I need to do? Hey. I need to buy myself another gun. For what? To carry. I was thinking about that. Maybe the Colt and the Conda. Hmm. That'd be a good one. Six inch burl, 44 Magnum. That'd be a good carry weapon. Don't you think? Uh, Costs about fourteen hundred dollars. You got fourteen hundred dollars to wait. Go no, for it. don't have. But hey, that's a girl. What do you think, Mrs. Coggin? Hey, I, I know what. I'll buy that that gun, and you can carry it when they have the constitutional carry. You're gonna strap that on. <laughs> Carry a 44 Magnum. <laughs> what am I gonna say? Dirty Harry, watch out. Uh, I'd say make my day if someone <laughs> does something. That Anaconda is nice and everything. Uh, it's uh, real shiny. It's real nice. Uh, it's a coat. Uh, mm -hmm. Excellent, excellent weapon. But I already have a 44. Those things are booger to shoot. I saw a video where uh, Biden was talking about the Second Amendment. It says that he don't feel where anybody needs to uh, carry a gun. After watching that, now I strap on two of them. Now I strap on two guns. Right. That's why you take care of that and open carry them by the means. By golly. And by golly, you show show the guns. So, uh, Scotty, you're funny. Well, I stand up for the Second funny. Amendment. That's the Second Amendment will be uh, uh, something I'll always stand up for. They want to knock on my door and come get my guns. That's not a good thing to do. Because they're not going to get the guns. I guess if they shoot and kill me, they will. Other than that, they're not getting them. I guarantee you that. That's something what I've strongly... Uh, represent. Also, uh, uh, what would represent whatever uh, is going to do good for our veterans out there, then I'm all for that also.
Is that a hospital or a shopping center? Oh, that's look, that's UMC. I didn't know UMC was there. Is that one of those walk-in things or? I haven't been this way in forever. They got a CBC yeah. over here. Well, that's new. Now we're getting into the North Point. Mm -hmm. I've never been through North Point. This must be a new addition because I don't remember this being here. Look at all these solar panels. We just never get out this way. Never have a reason to. has to be a new because I don't I don't remember this at all. But then I like I say I never get out this way. I haven't maybe it's been here I just don't recall. There's old drive in right there. I wonder if that thing still still going. It burned down one time, I think they, as I recall. It's got a little play, uh, little playground. Yeah, a little area on the side where you can. Junction 84. Well, this is where slide ends, and so does this video. Uh, hope y'all enjoyed the ride with Mrs. Scoggett and I and we'll have uh, another video uh, Sunday Drive next week we just don't know where we're going yet but hope y'all enjoyed it we, en we enjoyed having you along and y'all continue to stay safe out there and take care <laughs>